The race for the Kuala governor's seat is taking shape, with six aspirants declaring their intention to succeed Governor Salim Mvuria, who will be completing his second and final term of office in two months' time. The current Kuala deputy, direct, deputy governor and the only woman in the race, Fatima Achani, is among the contenders under the UDA ticket. Others in the race include former Matuga MP and Wiper National Chairman Chirao Ali Mwakwere, who is making a second stab at the seat. Kuala Speaker Sami Rua, who is running as an independent candidate. Or former Agriculture PS Professor Hamadi Boga, flying the Orange Democratic Party flag and a former KPA engineer Lungazi Chai Mangale, who is a new entrant, is in the contest with the Pamoja African Alliance. Francis Mutalaki reports. The race to succeed outgoing Governor Salim Mvuria of Kuala has so far attracted six aspirants. They will be eyeing some 281,041 registered voters from IBC 2017 records, although this number has increased with ongoing voter registration. <laughs> Kuala Deputy Governor Fatuma Chani is upbeat. The residents will give her an electoral mandate, having served under the current governor for the last 10 years. Tumetua Kuala pale lipokuwa mpaka pale ambapo tumefikisha sasa hivi. Na katika ruwa za yetu pamoja na mstaiki Governor Mvuria, hatuja kamilisha yale yote ambao tulitaka kuwafanyia wa Kuala. Ningependa niendelezeshe kazi ili ambao tumeianza ili tuweze kuhakikisha mkwale anaendelea ku benefit zaidi. Achani is banking on Salim Mvuria's development track record, but she's facing tough opposition from former agriculture PS Professor Hamadi Boga and former Matuga MP and Waipa Party National Chairman Ali Chirao Mokwere, who is making a second stab at the governor's contest, having lost to Salim Mvuria in 2017 the benefits of devolution have not been actualized i'm coming in as the next governor of Kuala because i know the people know what i'm capable of doing all the examples are found in matuga constituency when i was serving as the member of parliament for matuga matuga is in Kuala county the reference points are here and i feel i have the solutions for these challenges and i feel if elected as governor and granted political power by the will of the people of Kuala, we will be able to use their resources, we will be able to use the rich imagination and culture of Kuala people to bring about transformation. Having lost in 2017 before securing Kuala County Speaker, Sami Rua is at it again as an independent candidate. Hello, it's company Kuala. <laughs> With Pamoja African Alliance fronting former KPA engineer Lunganzi Chale Mangale, who is the new entrant. Nataka kuona uongozi wa serikali ya ugatuzi uko karibu na wale wananchi kule mashinani. Pia ningependa kuona tunaweza kupata huduma bila kujali dini, rangi ama kabila. Hii kwangu tutasema ni kama graduation. I know where to begin, I know about budgeting, I have been involved, I know about management of resources, I know about engaging with stakeholders, wakwale, uh, both public and private. Uh, so Niko na experience in public uh, management. Uh, above all, I have gone round ni mesikia expectations of an inch for the past 10 years. Kuala County has an estimated population of 866,820 of keen interest is the county's agricultural sector and the revival of factories for value addition. Ili kuweza kuenua maisha ya ya wakwale kupitia kwa utalii kilimo kuhakikisha pia watu wetu wako na maji masafi and there is a circle of poverty in kwale which i must break grandparents are poor parents are poor children are poor and i'll break the circle the way i try to do in matuga with success hakuna security mzuri hakuna lighting nzuri na hakuna programs uh, as well as other forms of industries so that Kuala can be productive. Tunataka kuendelezesha, kuongeza mabawa zaidi katika yale maeneo ambayo hayajafikiwa. Ndiyo sababu tuasema mamachani aendelee.
Kuali County is a bastion of tourism and aspirants are each pledging to improve the sector. Among other areas, for voters here, it is a season of choices. Idadi kubwa sana hasa hama eno yatu ya ukunda na mashinani. Wengi sana wamekuwa jobless. Tumepotelea kwa mguka, madrugs na yote ni courtesy of kuwa idol. Hashugulike wa mama sana, mwana sisi watu wengi. Tumezalishwa na tusaidiwe na ukienda huko na mbuo na zungusha hivu na zungusha hivu. Tunataka wangalia sekta utari. Kama vile tumetoka COVID, utari umeadhirika sana. As Governor Salim Mvuria prepares to leave office, residents are yearning for better services in the tourism sector, health, education and the land question as more than 300,000 registered voters are up for grab among the six contenders. Francis Mtalaki, Citizen TV, Diani, Kale County.